In Isaiah chapter 43, verse 19, Behold, I will do a new thing. Now shall spring forth. Shall you not know it? I will even make a way in the wilderness and rivers in the desert. In the book of Psalm chapter 32, verse 8, it's more clearer. Yeah, the Bible says, I will instruct thee and teach thee in the way which thou shalt go. I will guide thee with my heart. Close your hearts. Shout this prayer point loud and clear. Say, powers that want to use me and my family as a source of mockery. Powers that want to use me and my family as a source of mockery. Die in the name of Jesus. Die in the name of Jesus. Die in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV. Today, we are looking on a very important topic. The topic is dream about boss. Dream about boss. Well, this dream is not so frequent. But once they come, they come with various symbols and meanings. Buses are the means of transportation. They have a capacity as high as 300 passengers. Buses can be used for different purposes. If you use bus, if you use buses every day, it is common to see bus in your dream. If you are a bus driver watching me right now and you are be dreaming about bus, you are a bus driver and you are be seeing bus in your dream, then it calls for attention. So we have so meetings about bus. So we have the school bus, we have the company bus, we have various kinds of bus. When you are seeing bus in your dream, what does it connote? Number one, it represents direct and control. When you are seeing bus, it means God wants to direct the affairs of your life. Perhaps you are going on a journey. Perhaps you want to fulfill a particular assignment and you find yourself in a bus. It can also mean that God is leading you in the path of your calling. Praise the living Jesus. It means that God wants your progress. Some certain people want your progress. You were in that bus, you were moving. It means that you are going at the place, you are moving in the direction of your dreams and goals. In the name of Jesus. Then on the point of dreaming about bus is uh, planning, organizing, leading, and controlling. The meaning of boss in your dream is planning, organizing, leading, and uh, controlling. You are in that midst of seeing yourself in the boss. You are trying to plan some things. You are trying to organize. Maybe you are trying, you are a leader or you are a business person and you have some people working for you, it means a time for you to lead very well. It can also be a time for you to control, for you to control some certain situation. That's a dream about boss. May the Lord give you that control over your challenges in the name of Jesus. Then another meaning of dream about boss is ministerial and career fulfillment. When you see people in the boss, People in the bus, there are people. The Bible says, go into the world and teach, and teach the nation. Baptize them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Now, you are in that bus. That can also indicate ministerial calling. God wants you to evangelize. God wants you to preach about the gospel of Jesus Christ. It can also mean career fulfillment. God wants you to fulfill that career, that dream you have. That assignment God has been God, God, God wants is wanting you to do, and you have been putting it aside. The dream about boss is telling you for you to walk, revisit that goals again for God to work well on your dreams. Another meaning is discipline, another meaning is focusing, another meaning is progressive ambition, another meaning is God's plan for your life. And as we have the good side about the dream of both, we have the bad side. 
The bad side is delay and time wasting. The bad side is frustration and disappointment. The bad side is career failure and backwardness. The bad side is shame, disgrace and reproach. The bad side is joblessness, losses and destruction. The bad side is folly into temptation. The bad side is wrong place of destiny, lack of helper. I pray may you never lack helpers in the name of Jesus. If you are in a bus or you're in a bus stop and you are looking for somebody to lift you, I pray they will come. So when you are in a bus, it means you are in the right place of your destiny. When you are a bus driver and you are seeing yourself driving people, it can also mean that God wants to lead you. God wants to lead you very well. Or maybe you are under a leadership of somebody. God wants you to be submissive and obedient under the authority of that person. Praise the living Jesus. When you discover that the boss was unable to start, it means that there are some things that is causing delay in your life. Frustration, depression, disappointment. You have to deal with it. If you are dreaming about boss accident, then it means that uh, some things about your life is under satanic control. Tragedy, bad news. It may not necessarily mean that you are going to encounter boss accident. It can also mean that uh, a career defeat, problems in your destiny. It means that something you are facing in your real life that is, that is causing sorrow, that is causing weeping, that is causing regret. Because anything that has to do with accident, it has to do with sorrow and bad news. May you never have such as a Christian in Jesus' name. So when we are also having bus, uh, we are also having bus accident, it can also mean destiny about us. So may your destiny never be aborted in Jesus' name. So when you dream where you are on the bus stop waiting for a bus, you are on the bus stop waiting for a bus, it also be a good dream. But if a bus stop and you enter, in, when the bus stop and you enter the bus, it means that um, it indicates a divine favor. It means divine intervention and divine turnaround. But unfortunately, when you're on the, in the bus stop and you no know buses were able to stop, we are trying to, we are trying to get their attention. They are not stopping. It means that you have been ignored in life. You have been condemned in life. Are you a kind of person in a situation where you are now? You have been ignored. Nobody is ready to help you. You always f f were walking into promise and fail, rising and falling. This dream is telling you that something is wrong somewhere. Praise the living Jesus. When you are seeing scubas, the scubas in a dream, I mean, you are a mother watching these brokers, and you are seeing a scubas, and your children, normally, the scubas normally carry them to school off and, to and fro. Then, it's not something to worry about if the dream ended good. It tells you that um, your child or your children, they are under God's protection. Praise the living Jesus. And the school bus of your children, they will never encounter accident in Jesus' name. Because when your, when your child is in a school bus and the school bus refuses to start, it can also bring a delay to your child's destiny. It will make your child not to be smart in life. I pray may that not be your portion in Jesus' name. If you are missing a bus, it means you are missing an important event. You are missing an important person in your life, person that is about is supposed that has been ordained by God to do you good, but all of a sudden the person turned against you. You are missing a boss, bringing disappointment and shame. So when you are chasing after boss, it means that you are chasing after your dreams. You are chasing after your goals. You are trying to reconnect back to where God assigned you to do. You are trying to go back. You are chasing after it. That chasing after that boss can also mean that. Uh, you are trying to hook up with some certain important people in life. You believe that once you get close to them, they will be a good personality, a good things to you. So when you are driving bus to work, it means that uh, you are God is directing you, controlling you. God is God wants you to organize your life very well. Praise the living Jesus. So when you are in a bus overcrowded with people, where when you are in a bus overcrowded with people. It can also mean that God wants you, God wants you to pass a message to people who are in that bus because you are there for a purpose. God wants you to use that as a way of starting your career, as a way of testing. Because when we are as a child of God, we have that spirit of 
preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ, being the boss overcrowded, God wants you to deliver his assignment to certain people in life who are the person God has, has been telling you to pass a message across and you have been refusing. So you are in a crowded bus and God, you are listening to some voices and this crowded bus, they are distorting down voices that is the spirit of destruction. They are the spirit that does not want you to hear good news, to work on that good news. You need to stay away from crowded area that is trying to pollute or hinder the hinder you from listening directly to the, to the voice of God. Praise the living Jesus. So when, when you are buying a bus ticket, when you are buying a bus ticket, it means that you are, you are, you are planning, you are organizing your life. You are checking out, you are, you are looking at your dreams, the best way to fulfill that dreams. So when you are buying a, a, a bus ticket, it means that um, you are trying to make a progress in your career. Praise the living Jesus. So when you are driving a stolen bus, it means that uh, you are doing, you are fulfilling a wrong destiny. And that is not good. When you are driving a stolen bus, it means that you are doing some certain things which God is not happy about. If you are a child of God and you are finding yourself doing some certain things and God is not happy about, and you are coming home, you are bringing money to your wife, your children, and say, ah, I'm doing a good work, and yet you are doing a fraudulent work. God is not happy with it. Remove your hand from those bad, bad things. Praise the living Jesus. When you are dreaming about a new boss, a new boss represents new identity. A new boss represents power. A new boss represents a new focus, a new direction. When you are seeing an old boss, an old boss means that an old boss represents sin. An old boss represents an old anointing. An old boss means an old habit. So those things that are about to be influencing your life negatively as the case may be. Praise the living Jesus. So maybe in some cases you, you dream whereby you, you, you go to a wrong boss. When you go to the wrong boss, yeah, well, it can be a, a one chance, as they call it in Nigeria. A wrong, getting to a wrong boss is not good because you don't know the person that is in charge of that boss. You don't know the best people who are in that boss. And that one can lead you astray. And that one can lead you. That, that is a situation whereby some people will be leading you astray. They'll be telling you, follow this particular path. Follow this particular path. You'll be following them. Following them until they delay your time. May enemy never delay your time in Jesus' name. So in some cases whereby you are standing on a bus instead of sitting. You are standing on a bus instead of sitting. It means that uh, God has prepared a place, a seat for you. You have because of your spiritual blindness, you have refused to decode that. God has provided a seat of destiny for you, for you to relax, calm, and be peaceful with your challenges. But you did not know. God has played that seat for you. But instead of that, you will stand up on that vehicle. It's not good. That means that the enemy wants you to suffer. They want you to sweat and struggle. May you never experience that in Jesus' name. So, in some cases, whether you are getting out of the bus, it means that a fulfilled destiny, it means that uh, God has actually bring happiness and joy celebration in your life. Maybe you, you dream about you, have, you, you fell out of a moving bus. It means destiny, destiny about us. It means delayed destiny. It means anti other spirit, they are working against you. It means that something is not right with your destiny. It means that uh, whatever you lay your hand upon is not making progress in your life. Those are the bad things. So when you are dreaming about traveling with a bus, well, if you are planning to travel and you are seeing yourself traveling with a bus, it's telling you that you are trying to meet some important event. And if you are traveling with your bus and there's no obstruction, it means a successful career, a successful, a successful assignment, a successful journey. But you discover that there's an obstruction in that dream during your traveling. It means that the enemy wants to cause some certain bad news in your life. May it never come to pass in Jesus' name. So what are the way out? The way out to surrender your life to Christ. The way out to repent from every nonsense to Jesus. The way out to exercise patience when looking unto God. The way out to trust in God for everything and lean not unto your own understanding. The way out is to pray for God to restore all your wasted years. The way out is to ask the Holy Spirit to show you the way. The instructions to embark on just one day fasting and prayers 
and let God prevail over your matter in Jesus' name. I want you to take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, Oh Lord, drive me to the path of my destiny in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, drive me to the path of my destiny in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, any man, any woman that is leading me astray in life, any man, any woman that is leading me astray in life, be frustrated in the name of Jesus. Be frustrated in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, by the blood of Jesus, I uproot the spirit of stagnation in my foundation. In the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus, I uproot the spirit of stagnation in my foundation. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you are taking that prayer points, congratulations. The Lord will help you. If you are a bus driver, I pray the Lord will lead you to the place of your destiny. And there shall be good news in your career. I'm resources and testimony in Jesus' name. You may you never have aborted career, aborted dreams. The Lord will fulfill and intervene in your matter in Jesus' name. If you have a dream about bus, car, write them at the comment section. This is Evangelist Joshua, your brother in the school of dream interpretation.